there's anything you should know about this reporter, it's that one, I detest the cold weather, and two, I always dress inappropriately for it. For instance, I'm not wearing a hat, no gloves, and I have a light winter jacket out in negative two degrees weather. I caught up with some people here at the Highlands to see how they're preparing for this winter's cold conditions. There is no denying it. The weather outside is more than frightful. So frightful, in fact, that a usually bustling holiday season has seen places like the Highlands become more of a ghost town than an economy-stimulating paradise. I can't feel my face. <laughs> Currently, my, I mean, I, yeah, I'm growing a beard because my face gets really cold but right now. The wind is whipping in my face, and it's starting to freeze my cheeks. I'm trying to keep warm by trying to dress in layers when I go outside, try to make sure I wear gloves, and... When possible, try to wear things on my head, like hats, toboggans, things like that, just to try to keep the body heat conserved. Although this might seem like the coldest Ohio Valley December ever, that record actually belongs to the year 1914, when temperatures dropped to a blistering negative 26 degrees Fahrenheit. And even colder yet was the January of 1994, when temperatures dropped to a ridiculous negative 32 degrees Fahrenheit. Still, residents were not shy about offering tips on how to stay warm this winter. I, I like to use uh, some, some clothing that's very close to the, uh, the body, mostly like elastic kind of clothing. Um, kind of keeps the body heat close to the body. People should just limit their exposure. I don't I shouldn't say they shouldn't go outside when I mean, people have things to do, but they just have to be smart about it. And as you head out this winter, make sure you prepare for all emergency conditions. For instance, don't dress like me. Pack gloves, extra blankets, extra clothing, jumper cables, or a first aid kit. You might even want to make sure you have a full tank of gas everywhere you go. Make sure that you're always prepared for the winter weather conditions. For 7 News, this is Nathan Marshall, freezing to death.